Hey everyone, how's it going? Welcome back to Let's Play Resident Evil Wish Village. I have cleared the Duke out. Everything he's selling. Every upgrade. Um, I sold all of my treasure, and I still have 200,000 lay left over. Important than anything. Which makes me anything, a little bit suspicious. I still haven't found the other gem for the oh, necklace wow. with two holes, so we'll be turning that in later. Uh, we are dressed to the nines for whatever's coming, and I have this very fine fish to cook, too, to get some movement speed. I guess you could say I'm stuffed to the gills with ammo. Stuffed if to the gills the with ammo! Away. Did you, did you, We've did you get all it? All the ingredients. Stuffed now. to the, because the fish, fish have gills. We're, and stuffed to the gills, it's a phrase. We're Apologies stuffed the to the gills with ammo. Uh. <laughs> I wouldn't mind having that again. Oh wait, maybe we're not so stuffed to the gills. I'm, miss I'm missing exactly one fish. I can hardly wait for the next ingredients. Ingredient. There's only one more fish left. And if I go the rest of the game having already missed it, <laughs> then I guess that's not that big of a deal. Because it's only the smallest tier of health upgrade. I don't think... What's going on? What a good question. What a good question. Forgot about this. Oh yeah, the umbrella marker. I can't wait to find out what that's about. Is this taking us? This is not what I expected. I thought it was gonna be like a, a robot Salazar thing in the castle in RE4, <laughs> and the statues were gonna come to life. Don't worry about the kid, Ethan. It'll be fine. Ha! Just get your ass across the bridge. Okay. I'm a little bit wary. Ah! Uh, Ethan Winters. Welcome. I didn't think you'd make it past Daughter Moreau, but I suppose you survived worse back in America, hmm? I like you. I'd like to speak to you about Rose and Miranda. Oh, come on in. Don't worry. It's not a trap. What are you planning? It's not a trap, says man with finger hovering over the button labeled trap. <laughs> So what I'm wondering is, uh, this, this waterfall, is this the same waterfall we saw? Is, is this the waterfall on the side of the cliff where Donna Beneviento's house is lodged? Okay, well, I guess Ethan will just go Bumble his dopey ass into this huge trap. Just gonna trundle my way into the factory. 
I'm noticing a lot of tanks out here. A lot of tanks. This is quite a few tanks. How did they get here? They wouldn't just they wouldn't just dress the set with tanks if that wasn't relevant, right? What the fuck is gonna happen? <laughs> First, before we fall for this trap, let's get whatever items we can scrounge up. This is so deeply suspicious. I love the distant sound of metal groaning. It has such a haunting quality to it, just like inherently. Oh, he's been monitoring all of the lords being killed by Ethan. What the hell? Mia? Um? Truth hurts, don't <sighs> Let me guess. You're saying take me out like the others, and then he gets going save Rose, right? I'm healing my daughter. Look, you, you, you got this all wrong. Demental. Shut your fucking hole! I'm sorry about that. Take a seat. Listen, Ethan, you're being played. What are you talking about? You think this is a game? I said shit! <sighs> Lady, supersized bitch. Ugly ass psycho doll. An emeronic freak. Don't you get it? It's a test. To see if you're strong enough to be a part of Miranda's family. I don't want to be a part of Miranda's family. Neither did I, but here we are. And I'm next in line, right? Kill me, move up the chain. Well, fuck that! I don't give a damn about your personal issues. I just want to fix my daughter. <laughs> so do I. Do you have any idea how powerful a kid is? Even Miranda's scared of her. Last time, you freak! I swear to God! You and me, Ethan. Together, we can go save Rose, and we can use her to grind Miranda into paste. My daughter is not a weapon. Fuck you! <laughs> Last chance. You don't want to find out what's in that hole. I'll take my chances. You're few. Wait, 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 wait! Arth told me. Four words. Chainsaw go kart. Is this it? Holy shit. Oh my god. I am easing out. A dead end. Uh damn it. What was that thing? Man, the industrial body horror aesthetic here is really strong right off the bat. But I do not think that's... That's what 
Earth told me about. Four words. Four words is what he gave me. As a teaser. I cannot wait. <laughs> so yeah, this is gonna be our... Our lab, our factory, our... Industrial setting on the island. Ooh, you're a bit new. That and these probably shield their heads a little bit. Yeah, it looks like it. You getting up? No? Okay. So other than the protective headwear, uh, doesn't seem to be too much of a difference between them and the regular zombies or the Maroikas. This team, this, the, the new, the team for the new games does something so well, and it's the industrial, uh, more like techy lab response. Oh! I've got to get upstairs. Whoa! Midgar? What? Holy shit! I wonder if I could shoot one of them down. I think that was a little bit too early. That was right over the head, though. Ah. Holy shit! That's exactly what I'm talking about! This is unbelievable! This is so cool looking! <laughs> They really get that ugly beauty just right. It's because they have so much really strong, dramatic lighting in them. That's where shit really gets cooking. <laughs> Absolutely Welcome, breathtaking. Ethan. I've procured some new items for you, Mr. Winters. Oh man, I'm gonna chill for a second. That's so good. Oh, now, now we get a new, oh yeah, we actually have a whole suite of new weapons to buy. I'm guessing new upgrades to go with them. Another attache case upgrade. God created man's back to carry burdens, but to think you want to pile on even more. <laughs> So, not knowing whether or not these are just going to be straight upgrades or if there's maybe a more, uh, a little bit more personalization to it, like, uh, like in Resident Evil 4, where you have a few guns that are technically better than, than their predecessors that you're meant to directly replace, but then some things come down to, like, Delighted to. a matter of, of style or personal personal preference so I'm skilled at also I'm gonna weapons modifications. I'm gonna leave them alone have a wonderful adventure. I'm gonna leave them alone for just a little bit and then probably honestly look up their actual stats uh, off screen and since we can sell the guns for the full value of their upgrade ooh, 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 ooh. I'm loving this lighting too yeah, since we can sell guns for the full value of their upgrades. Uh, there's no reason to really not invest into what we have. What do we got? Oh, it's shattered. It looks like if I hit them right over the glowing eye part of the metal headband, it looks like it shatters immediately. Oh, 
Oh, hello. Thought he was getting ready to stagger over, but so I started reloading. Yeah, all the really strong light sources reflecting off of uh, off of the dirty, rusted metal. It's very grungy. And this team does that look very well. Okay, we're good. I'm not too worried about these. I got both of them at once! Yeah! Yeah, I'm not too worried about about these. Um, something that does make me a little bit tense is the idea of being stalked uh, in, a, in a similar manner to that of Dimitrescu or uh, uh, Jack Baker or Mr. X or Nemesis by Propeller Boy. <laughs> Looks like a foundry? Some kind of workshop? Yeah, more of a workshop. Uh, we have nothing for this. This looks like it's gonna be some kind of puzzle hint. I cannot make out what this is. Or is this just, uh, documentation of, like, how he implanted the upgrades. As far as I can tell, it's not a clue for a puzzle. Casting machine. Can't use it without a mold. Okay. Come on. Oh wait, there's I'd like you to group up a little bit. This should reach him now. We have so many pipe bombs. That wasting a few is not that big of a deal. Plus, I would not call that a waste. I would call that efficiency. Not enough power. Okay, we can always come back for that. Ooh, 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 ooh! Okay, this is what I mean by dramatic lighting and composition. This incredible backlighting that makes them into a silhouette. I love that. That that's one of my favorite lighting techniques. Lighting is my jam. You're gonna come to life at some point, aren't you? And you get to have this look this good, uh, in part because of, of, oh, there we go. Now he's coming to life. Yeah. Okay, so he, he's gonna be like a regenerator where he's like a really strong recurring enemy for the area. Again, with a really nice industrial body horror. Come on. And you get to have the lighting look this good because of ray tracing, uh, which allows you to get these intense floodlights lighting the area much more like how light actually works without needing like a dozen really peculiar little baked in light source is trying to more. Whew. trying to badly repl replicate that effect honestly the jump from wow that's cool <laughs> the 
the jump from 1080 to 4K is not that significant. It's small enough that I haven't bothered upgrading yet and getting a new TV. That's a lot of money still, I, I think, for not enough. Uh, because with resolution, you eventually hit those diminishing returns, but with more processing power, you can do a lot to improve things like lighting. And this, this team's ability to dramatically light a creepy scene is they're flexing. They are flexing with this area. Uh, so I think that's going to do it for now. Thank you all for watching. Take it easy. Have a good one, y'all.